Today, science fiction has turned to fact. Aliens have arrived. And they've challenged us to a game of football. The race is on to find the team to defend Earth. Can football save the planet? It seems we have our captain. Messi is in. Who will be chosen next? Strikers or midfielders? What about defence? You want defence? is now complete. This is our best hope. Our best, our bravest. Our team. Today, science fiction has turned to fact. Aliens have arrived.
the beautiful game it used to be all ours earth's favorite game we don't know why this alien race has challenged us but we do know that they have every intention of destroying earth that is if we lose our only chance lies with the galaxy 11 and i say for the good of us all football must save the planet it's time And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The months of training are behind them, and the challenge for Earth begins now. And what a strange pitch we have here. The curved walls keeping the ball in play all the time should actually suit our attacking team rather nicely. They have been handpicked from the world's most famous clubs, but this is the first time any of these footballers have actually played together. Maybe Beckenbauer knew what he was doing by selecting all of these strikers. Look at the size of the Huracan team. Goodness me, it's no wonder they're undefeated. Well, it looks as though the Galaxy 11 will kick off. Oh, a bit of early intimidation on Messi here from Lennox, who I have to say is absolutely massive. I just hope they don't have the quickness to match their size. Just how are we going to defend against these beasts when we have no true defensive players? It's certainly not a good time for a tactical gamble. For a long time, arch rivals, now key teammates, Messi and Ronaldo, ready to get us underway. And the stakes could not be higher. The battle for Earth survival is well and truly on, and quite a battle it's going to be. That was Lennox on Messi. Well, that's an astonishing reach by Ripsit with the interception. Yokte, fantastic effort off the curve wall, and it's gone into the centre. Here's Lennox, an amazing acrobatic overhead kick. It's ripped past Casillas, the goalkeeper, no chance at all. 1 0 to the Huracan. They do look bewildered, the Galaxy 11, disorganised as well. Beckenbauer and the lads need to pull themselves together and quick. The fate of all humanity hangs in the balance. 11 different styles and personalities. Well, they'll have to unite and try to play as one. The game restarted by the Galaxy 11 and Mario Goetze. They certainly worked out the conditions here using the curve wall superbly. And it's a terrific turn from the German as well. He's looked to spring it to Ronaldo, who's taken that down. Great class, and he's taken down with no class by Chotka who's going to get a yellow card from the alien referee. This is perfectly set up for Cristiano Ronaldo and how his team need him. It's a brilliant free kick and the save, I have to say, is even better. Ronaldo can't believe it. He's devastated. The throw from Akachau to the save is terrific too to Uptik. He's got Ixot out wide. Ripson is making his way into the middle, looking for something special here, and he's come up with it, oh, Casillas might have picked that out, but he's hurt his shoulder, it's a second goal for the Huracan, and the Galaxy 11 have more problems. So 2-0 down, the Galaxy 11 really need to make something happen and soon. And here's the man who can make it happen, Lionel Messi, dancing past defenders in his characteristically brilliant style. He's still going Messi, and he's drawn the goalkeeper and beaten him too. And he scored a marvellous goal, one from the Messi album. It's just brilliant in the nick of time, 2-1. 
And the Galaxy 11 are right back in this one. A terrific contribution from the captain, but Lennox is furious. They've never conceded a goal until now. Hurricane set the ball rolling again there. Pretty annoyed with the situation here, having conceded. They want to impose their will on the Galaxy 11 again. But in comes Lee Chung Yong, that was a terrific challenge. The ball broke to Oscar, who's in a crossing position here. He's got Messi in the middle, he's got Ronaldo in the middle. Oh, and they've got in each other's way and ruined the moment. It's a simple save for Akac. And Kurukan can show again this astonishing blend of technique, talent, pace, power. And even Victor Moses coming in there can't stop them. This attack has got a real hint of menace about it. It's a great threat to Galaxy 11. It could be 3 1. It is 3 1. But for Galaxy 11 and the fate of planet Earth, it is very bad news. Well, there is the halftime whistle. And for the Galaxy 11, it hasn't come soon enough. So it's with Beckenbauer and Messi. Big task to get these guys playing like a team. Can football save the planet? The aliens have arrived and they've challenged us to a game of football. Can football save the planet?
Okay, everyone, a collective deep breath. Here we are, we're all in. The fate of the entire planet rests with these men. Come on, lads, victory can't come unless we do play as one. Beckenbauer giving the team one last piece of instruction. And for the second half, out go Wu Lei and Moses, in come Kershikov and Donovan. And there is some information that seemed to be of some use. Let's hope so. The world has come together to cheer the Galaxy 11. Now, if only they can come together in this second half. 45 minutes to free 7 billion people. The question remains, can football save the planet? We can do it! And it's rips it with the crossfield ball. Chopka takes it very cleverly away from El Sharawi. And he's put Lennox in on goal here. And this could be the key moment. This could be the end of it for the planet. It's Lennox against Casillas. If he scores, that's surely the end for all of us. But Casillas, with a phenomenal save, keeps the game alive. He may have kept us all alive here. It's a much more confident Galaxy 11 in the second half. Lee Chung Yong to Oscar. On to Donovan. Messi is inspiring this team with his leadership. There's no question about that. In goes Falcao. And the Galaxy 11 have pulled one back. 3 2. Well, Beckenbauer looks to be making a tactical switch, a formation change. Well, it's still possible to get back into this game. But Beckenbauer couldn't be happier. And celebration around the globe. Can you believe it? Two minutes of added extra time. Time for another Huracan attack. This could spell doom for humanity. Lennox is such an amazing player. He's taking them all on. And he's going to be in on goal here. There's only Rooney who can stop him. And Rooney does with a terrific tackle. But it is a free kick. Casillas wants a wall, a very dangerous place to give up a free kick. Ronaldo talking to Messi, they've got to be together here. This could end humanity. Casillas is ready. It's over the wall, can Casillas reach it? Oh, how did he do that? He's turned it against the post. Now it's with Lee Chung Young, and the Galaxy 11 might have a last opportunity here. Oscar to Goetze to Donovan. On to Kershikov. Falcao coming back to receive it. To Messi. And Messi looking up. Ronaldo's getting into the box. The dream duo could combine here in the nick of time. Cristiano Ronaldo! It's an extraordinary goal and an extraordinary time. He's kept us all alive. That is the final whistle. Huracan 3, Galaxy 11, 4. Absolutely amazing. We're all still alive because of them. What a match. Extraordinarily intense moments there. We could hardly have dared to hope that this would happen. But it has happened. They've made it happen. The collective dream of the world has come true because the Galaxy 11 played as one. Football truly did save the planet. Thank you, Galaxy 11.